you know, when we're when we get a root canal, we're told that part of the procedure is to sterilize that. Is that even possible to make that area sterile and clean of infection? No, it's not. And the reason it's not is a number of reasons. The first reason is once the infection is present in there, when they're doing the procedure and when they're going through the mouth and routing out everything, they have miles of perpendicular tubules called dentinal tubules. And they're so small that pathogens get inside them in a row. And we actually have electron microscopic photos of this in the book to show it's not just somebody's fantasy, but those bacteria are there. Those bacteria cannot be reached by antibiotics, okay? And even if they could, it would be very unlikely you could ever sterilize it because you need a delivery system to get anything somewhere in the body. And that delivery system is blood vessels, connective tissue. Immune cells don't magically appear somewhere. They're, they're physical entities and they need a physical matrix to get from one mm. place of the body to another. And what you did was just you took out the entirety of that physical matrix when you cored the pulp out of the tooth. So mm. there's no way with that lack of a vascular system that you'll ever sterilize a root canal. And even if you were able to, let's say some people think they could do great things with ozone, and ozone is good stuff, but you might, at the very best, have a quick temporary sterilization, but the moment the procedure's over, the lack of the ability to the, of the immune system to get there is going to allow the natural pathogens present in the mouth to recolonate and reset the infection once again. Mm.